The CAPKI tool is included in the installation package. It secures communications between the service manager and all of its clients via TLS. Note that CAPKI secures only service manager communications. AE connections are also secured via TLS, but require a more complete certificate-based infrastructure. We're going to install CAPKI. The process is fairly easy with a simple setup command. In the architecture diagram, we install CAPKI on the AE host because we're also going to install a service manager there. This instance of the service manager will control AE processes locally. Later, we'll install one on the Windows host for another service manager. We'll explain why later. We haven't covered the service manager as of yet. It's a simple tool that provides interactive control over any process in the atomic environments. One of this course's modules is dedicated to it. Service Manager can manage services that are process-based, including AE, Agents, and AWI, and connect to other service managers. TLS encryption is required at both ends. It's possible to remote control an automation engine from another system. CAPKI has to be installed on both hosts. CAPKI is installed with root or admin privileges. It takes a few seconds. Occasionally, you'll run into issues after the installation of the components. Use logs to determine if your service managers and AE processes can find the CAPKI libraries. If they're missing, just run the CAPKI setup again. Here are the code snippets. We can just execute the CAPKI setup command directly from the install package. From this point forward, we're assuming the slash opt slash atomic file system has been created, Java has been configured, and the installation package has been downloaded, uncompressed, and untarred. We won't show this again. We sudo or log in as roots. Change the mode and ownership if you run into permission issues. We install CAPKI from the tools directory of the install package. It has its own directory. Setup is found in slash unix slash linux slash x64. It requires a number of options. The caller is an arbitrary name. Verbosity can be set and env equals all will set environment variables for all users in the system. We're now on the AE host. We ping the database host to show we're able to reach the database. 